Welcome to lesson two, Spanish language. The, it is uh, very important with the pr uh, pronouns and uh, we are using very, very usually when we talk. And also the verb to be, uh, which is uh, different in uh, Spanish and uh, we are going through in this lesson of uh, pronouns and uh, the verb to be. I is yo, yo. You is tu, tu. When it is informal, when it is informal, when uh, you are with very best friend or your uh, family you are using to but in formal you are using usted usted he is el el she is ella ella we is nosotros when it is for male, masculine, uh, or mix of masculine and feminine, feminine. and uh, nosotras is for feminine or female. You, vosotros, or vosotras, for informal, and for formal, ustedes. Ustedes. They is ellos or ellas. Now repeat after me. Yo, tú, usted, él. Ella. Nosotros. Nosotras. Vosotros. Vosotras. Ustedes. Ellos. Ellas. To be is ser or star. It is two verbs in Spanish. Ser or star. Both means to be. Ser use, is used for permanent uh, pos uh, situation and star used for temporary situation. Soy the Americano. Soy the Americano. I am American. I am American. Estoy en la oficiano. Estoy en la oficiano. Fian. Oficina. Estoy en la oficina. I am in the office. As you know, when you are talking about your nationality, it is ser you, am, you use, and for uh, a temporary place or a temporary situation, you are using a stoy or a star. So ser, is used for physical characteristics, personality traits, a country, city, place of origin, time, ownership, professions. The verb ser is used to express 
place of origin, occupation, nationality, essential qualities, religious or political affiliation, the material something is made of possessions, relationship of one person to another, the time, day, and date, where an event is taking place. Then you use ser. Now we look to the usage of the star. Where are you? Donde estas? Donde estas? I am in the office. Estoy en la oficia, fi, oficina. Estoy en el oficina. Where is Spain? Donde esta España? Donde esta España? This is your ge geography and physical location. The Spain is in Europe. España está en Europa. How are you? ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás? I am fine. Estoy bien. Estoy bien. How is the food? ¿Cómo está la Can comida. Como está la comida? To express a state or condition. Como está la comida? The food is cold. La comida está fría. La comida está fría. Food is comida. Cold is fría. The verb star uses the geographical and physical location, a state or condition like being sick, being lost, etc. Thank you for watching. It was the... No, it is continue here. We are going to uh, spell the verb soy in uh, present tense I am yo soy yo soy urbara soy you are tu eres tu eres usted es is also you are informal Uh, formal uh, form he or she is is el or ella es el or ella es we are nosotros or nosotras somos nosotros or nosotras somos you are vosotros or vosotras sois vosotros o vosotras sois. Informer, formal form is ustedes son. Ustedes son. They are. Ellos, ellas son. Ellos, ellas son. As you see in the all those the the translation or uh, verb ser they have different different uh, form for each pronouns soy eres es somos sois son This is uh, what is the uh, make Spanish language 
a little difficult but uh, there is a lot of rules that you can learn very quick and ser is a irregular form it is irregular form star is to be also I am joy stoy or only stoy tu estas tu estas or usted esta usted esta el or ella esta el or ella esta nosotros estamos nosotros estamos vosotros estáis vosotros estáis or ustedes están ustedes están they are is ellos or ellas están ellos or ellas están no repeat after me yo soy tú eres usted es él es ella es nosotros somos shake <coughs> excuse me nosotras somos nosotras sois nosotras sois ustedes son ellos son ellas son yo estoy Tú estás. Usted está. Él está. Ella está. Nosotros estamos. Vosotros estáis. Ustedes están. Ellos están. Ellas están. As you see, when we have a sign over e or a or u, which is uh, which are locals, they are going uh, to spell very short, very short, and. Uh, uh, very heavy tu el a we are going to use uh, these uh, words during uh, the lesson and you are going to learn very quickly when we repeat too many times we learn very quickly thank you for watching see you in the next lesson